A sad story in Brevard County, a police dog dead after his handler left him in a hot car. We first brought you this as breaking news at noon today. Now we are working to get more answers from police. We're told an officer from Sebastian along the Indian River County line left the dog in his car outside the Brevard County Courthouse in Melbourne. This happened back on Friday. New for five tonight, New Six's James Barvero talked with investigators. On a day that Melbourne set a heat record, a police officer's canine dies in the handler's hot car. Police say what happened Friday is a tragedy for all local law enforcement. This is a tremendously sad day, personally and professionally. Certainly a deceased canine, a heartbreaking situation. From Sebastian to Melbourne, officers mourning the loss of Diesel, a German Shepherd police say died when the dog was left in his handler's hot car for hours. It appears to be a tragic mistake. Leading this investigation, Melbourne police say they don't know yet what the Sebastian officer was doing at the courthouse Friday or under what conditions he left the dog in the car. They say it was 7.30 at night when the officer discovered the dog was dead hours after the day in court. Did that catch everyone off guard? Was it just something so out of the blue to hear a dead canine? It's certainly not the usual call. Police say Diesel was with Sebastian PD for a year. He was tremendously social, just a great animal. And in that time, police say Diesel was loved by his handler. That's why police say it's unlikely any possible animal cruelty charges would be enhanced because of the dog being considered an officer too. If the car was turned off, if the windows were not cracked, if the AC was not running, should this officer be held accountable in terms of being charged? Those are all the things that are being looked at with the case. Canine handlers have the utmost love and respect for the animals that they are entrusted to care for. Sometimes these mistakes do happen. It's a very difficult investigation for everybody to go to. In Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, News 6.